Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am going to do the week of May um, 23rd. Yeah, that's what it says. Okay, the 23rd. <laughs> anyway, the week of May 23rd in my Erin Condren vertical. I'm going to use this kit from Nicole Alexia Designs. This kit does say it's for the 4th of July, but it's Memorial Day weekend coming up and I'm going to use this kit. I think it still fits. So, Let's get into this. All right, how's everybody doing? I am um, tired. It's the end of the school year. The kids are ready to be on vacation. The teachers are ready to be on vacation. Where are you guys up to? I know there's a lot of graduations going on. Um, a lot of cool, fun stuff. Memorial Day weekend is going to be a good time um and hopefully you know what i don't even care about those lines sticking out this week it's one of those weekends hopefully everybody gets some time off gets to spend some time with their families um i know that's what we like to use the weekend for and to really just appreciate everything that we have so Let's see if that fits. Okay. So yeah, these are a little bit short. Um, and that's okay. I'm okay with it. Um, some weeks I would white out the extra black line on the edge. But you know what? This week I just... I am too tired to fuss about it. Um, let's see. I'm going to put this one up here instead of down there because I'm going to put the weather down there I've been liking doing that lately so let's see do I want to put this one here or what do I want to do think 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 okay so if you are new to my channel welcome to my weekly indecisiveness that I tend to broadcast all over the internet um I know I should probably know more of what I'm going to do before I start these planning sessions but then you wouldn't be getting a peek into what it is to work on a planning session, I guess. Anyway, what are you guys doing? What are you guys watching? What's what's going on? So for my family, my kids are totally into the Harry Potter thing right now. Now, don't get me wrong. It's not like I've never exposed them to Harry Potter. However, my son is reading the books again. Um, he's one of those kids that can just read the same series over and over. I can't do that, but he is. So he's reading through them again, he's watching the videos again, and so it's just been a theme in the house. Um, we did get him started last night, though, on Lord of the Rings. So, <laughs> we'll see how that ends up. Um, so yeah, that's just been the big, the big action in the house this week, is him and his Harry Potter stuff, it keeps him happy. Um, my daughter, she is over the moon right now. I just gave her her own little planner and some stickers, and she's been having a great time with that. Um, she's definitely my mini-me. I do not have any date dots with this kit, so let's go ahead and go to the binder. What did I say? We're starting with the 23rd. What color do I want to do this? Right, let's see. I think we'll do this now. What do I want to do? Goodness, yeah, you're going to hear them downstairs because they're loud. Um, I don't know if that fits. It's kind of a big blocky kind of number there for them. Let's see. <laughs> okay. I don't think I want to do foil, but let's look at my foil stash and see what I have in those. So for those of you who are new to my channel, I take any extra date dots or whatever from my kits and anything I've ordered and I kind of put them in this binder. Um, that's a sparkly one. So that when I do have a kit here that does not have any date dots, I can just kind of go to it and pull from it. Um, which I probably should have figured out before I started this video. So, give me a second and I'll be back with what. Okay, so I did find some 
hollow numbers that I think will go on this pretty well. So Monday is the 23rd. And of course, the 24th is the sticker that popped off first. So I'm going to put that on there. Um, really don't have too much this week. It's it's going to be a week of normal chores, meetings, um, but nothing too much, which is good because it's been a really, really busy few weeks and I, I'm thankful for when I have these calm weeks. Now it has been getting a lot hotter outside and of course the day I decide to film, you know, it's overcast so my natural light isn't the greatest, but it has been super hot around here. And if that keeps it up, we might have to start going to the pool or something. So that that could be something to look forward to. All right, I need to stop talking and make sure I'm numbering these correctly. 2, 3, 24, 2, 5, 2, 6, 7, 28, 29. All right, got those on there. Okay, let's get these put on here. Monday, I think, let's see. I don't know if I'm gonna need to white this out or not. Nah, I think I'm gonna be good without whiting it out. It's a dark enough color swatch, but I might need to zoom you in a little more so you can actually see what I'm doing. That could be helpful. Okay, well, I was gonna go see the new Downton Abbey movie and the plans didn't work out well but you know what I did instead I took a glorious nap and I think that ended up being so much more of a self-care event than going to a movie would have been so I'm kind of happy about that um, but it still leaves that is another one of those things I'd like to go do um, or I could just wait until it's out on like HBO Plus or whatever streaming service it's going to be out on and stream it eventually. Which, knowing me, as much as I say I want to go out and do things when it comes right down to it, I'd rather be at home. So I'll probably do that. Um, let's see, we got Saturday in here. We have a break from sports. We did all of the last championship type games and the trophies last weekend or the weekend before I don't know the days are running together so I have a nice open weekend okay so I've got my base down here basically let me back out okay so I got the washi on and the date covers um here is the what's left of this just one sheet. So it looks like I'll be using most of it this week. Now I need to figure out what I wanna put here for my box. Originally, I thought I was gonna do this flag right here um, because I liked the script on it. But the box that I'm gonna use for my meal plan is that same blue color. And so that's, that's too much blue right there next to each other. I think what I'm gonna do instead is this flower. This flower is real pretty. All right, I'll throw that one in there. Okay, and then what kind of headers do we have? So this kit has these blue striped headers, these red bow headers, and then I also pulled out this um, Stardust from Simply Gilded. So it's a red, white, and blue Stardust. Kind of reminds me of like those, um, oh, it's even got a picture of it right here. One of these popsicles. I thought it was kind of cool. So I, it matches pretty well with the kit. Um, where do I want to put it though? Do I want to use the bow or the line? No, you know what? I'm going to do this. I'm going to put this here. Like so right on that line right there. Okay, washi cutter, where'd you go?
All right, and the leftovers get put in my book. So I have this page in my Archer and Olive bullet journal that I just put all of my little pieces. Well, makes kind of a cool collage, I guess. I don't feel as wasteful doing that. Okay, and then here, I'll put the meal plan sticker right here underneath it. And it kind of lines right up there. I'm gonna leave a little gap though. Lines right up with, is that straight? Straight enough. Okay, so the thing about the Nicole Alexia Designs kits, I really like our kits, I love the foiling. They don't have um, scripts. So I'm gonna pull in some scripts. Um, what I'm looking for is my on the menu ones, which might have gotten put in this book. I try to put the, the stickers that I'm using most each week in this book. So I'm going to need to order some more of these. I really like these from Lexi Kylie Designs for on the menu. Each one is in a different font. I think for this week, I'm going to go with, I like this one up here. It's a little crooked. Yeah, well, it's on there now. So, okay. On the menu. There we go. Okay. All right. So, next, let's get the weather in there because I'm going to end up filling this spot with some of this deco sheet probably. Um, yeah, so let me get the weather in here and then, um, I'll be right back. Okay. So I got my weather icons in. I use these transparent, um, weather stickers from Adorably Amy Designs. Um, I have so many of them. She had a sale a while back and I mean a while back and I got so many of them that I'm going to have enough weather stickers for like the next five years. Um, so remember that comment I said about how it's been super duper hot here and I might have to start taking the kids to the beach or the pool? Yeah, no, that's not going to happen. It looks like it's going to get rainstorms all week, but hey, <laughs> it was a positive outlook, right? Okay. So my kids had field day scheduled for last Friday and it was super hot. We were in black flag conditions. They couldn't do the older grades field day in the afternoon. Um, so if you're not from this area and aren't sure what black flag conditions are, that is when the heat index is too high, the humidity is too high for the kids to be safely outside and doing outside activities. So my son's field day got changed. Instead of doing his last Friday, he gets to do his field day Monday, but in the morning. So we're going to go ahead and add field day in here. He was kind of upset about it because that means that it was really funny why he was upset. He was upset because they were still going to get their ice cream on Friday, but that means that when they were doing field day on Monday when he was hot, he wasn't going to have his ice cream when he was hot. So he knew he was still getting ice cream, but it didn't make sense to him not to have it when they were hot from being outside. He is my logical kid. Um, kind of cracks me up. So there's that. All right. Um, let's see. The next thing I have on here, Monday, I also have a meeting. So I'm going to go ahead and use this one here. And I think I want to put, I want to do a header in between it. I do. I really like these headers. These are kind of like I want to say they look just like the Simply Gilded bows, but, you know, a bow is a bow. So, I'm going to put this in here. I do have a meeting here on this day. Um, my meeting stickers are here. I might actually be working my way through these sheets. I am really trying to use through everything that I've either made myself or purchased before getting new things. So I do have a meeting 
on Monday. And actually, look at this, I get to use up this sheet today. So that sheet is empty, it can go. And then, because on Thursday, I'm also going to have a meeting. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that on for when it's time for Thursday's meeting. Okay, um, back to Monday. So I'm gonna use, I think, I'm gonna use one of these blue lines. These are pretty. These headers are cool, I like this. And separate, actually, I wanna put it here because there. Because I have lines to help me, that's why. Okay, now what? full box do I want to put? I did flowers, so I don't want to do flowers yet. I think I'm going to do, you know what? I talked about the ice cream and his field day, so that's what we're going to do. We're going to put the ice cream down for field day. Ooh, these are super sticky. Okay, that probably means I need to make sure not to mess it up. I don't know if I'm going to be able to pull these up if I do, so. All right, grab that and then I'm gonna pop in a little bit of this Simply Gilded Washi for fun. Why not? And I'm gonna line that right up with that. I could kind of still see that line though. So if I bring it down a little bit lower they can get the red. Nope, I'm gonna be fussy. So yeah, looking on the calendar, I probably should have used um, this kit next week, being as Memorial Day is next Monday. But this has the weekend on it previous to this considered Memorial Day weekend. So I don't know. There's, there's no right or wrong on choosing when to use what kit or whatever. It's just how I had it in my plans and I, when I made that decision, that's that's how that ended up. All right, so down here, I know we do have to have homework done. Now, the red isn't quite, it's more of a pink on this homework. Do I have another sheet? Let's see. Let's see. It's not quite a red, so I think I'm gonna go with, I'm gonna start this one off with just black and do I want to do labels? I only have one, two, three more labels left. Oh, look at that. Found another box. Found another sheet. Perfect. Okay. Um, I'm going to do this one on here. So I'm going to get homework done in the evening. There we go. All right, and then I'll make sure those go on those other days too. And then let's see, what color flag should we put here? I think blue, blue would look good here. No, come on, come off of there. There we go. Sometimes with this premium matte paper, it's hard to get it off of there. Um, I'm gonna throw this right here with that washi for my little to-do section, things that need to get done that day, right there. All right, okay, Monday is done. So let's move to Tuesday. What is going on on Tuesday? I do not have a meeting in the morning so far, but Tuesday is super exciting because where did my other big boxes go? I am losing my mind. I'm holding the sheet in my hand. Okay. Um, which one do I want to use? I don't know which one I want to use. I'm going to use this red one here. Super exciting because this... I'm going to put this one down a little. Same exact is when the Erin Condren seasonal surprise boxes go on sale. So let's get that in there. Oh, 
I wasn't gonna be able to fit both words, so I abbreviated that one a little bit. Um, so I usually get the, bro the boxes. Um, not gonna lie, the last few have not been great. There's been one or two things that I have used in them, but I always use things for gifts if it's not my own personal style. <laughs> my daughter's in here working on her little book. I gave her some stickers today. She's doing her own creative thing. All right, now, um, back to Tuesday. I do have a meeting on Tuesday. Let's see. I'm going to put this one here. Okay. So I'm going to put this one here. Okay. That one there. And then I'll get my meeting sticker out. in half real quick. I just ended with a red header. So let's do, I guess a blue box would probably be good. Um, oh, forgot. I still have these. You know what? I'm going to do a flower box. Yeah, I'll do this flower box right here. there. I'm going to wipe this out. All right, staff meeting. I'm going to throw, I'm going to do the same washi thing right below it too. Whole lot of room for that next homework sticker does it um well we'll make it work so i'm gonna put a blue homework sticker there and maybe i just don't need to put a box with it maybe i could do a layering piece to it I could move these up a little because I did space it out, but like I said, it's that premium mat and sometimes it pulls up, or it, I, I shouldn't say that it doesn't pull up the paper because honestly, I haven't had that experience with this kit yet because I haven't pulled it up, but I get worried that it's going to pull up the paper. So we're just gonna layer this one right there. There we go. All right, so we have homework on there and we have the list. Okay, let's move on to Wednesday. Wednesday, I do not have any meetings in the morning, which honestly, I'm saying that now, but as I get to work, my meetings are gonna just fill up super fast because that's just what happens. Um, so in my work planner is where I'll get more detailed with that and keep track of it, but um, I'll put a header on that. No, I'm just going to go straight down with the sticker. Um, I know this is my, you know, at home personal planner and memory planner and my creative outlet. I put the meetings in here just to give myself like an overview of what's going on with the week so I know what I'm looking at. So um, let's put this header here. All right. That one's a little crooked. I don't know if I'm going to be able to live with that. 
Oh, we're gonna find out if this. Oh, look at that, they are removable. Well, that's nice. Now that we know it's definitely removable, I'm gonna be a little more fussy, aren't I? Okay. All right. Perfect. Okay. So here, what's going on on Wednesday? I don't have a meeting Wednesday. It is garbage day. Um, I don't have any icons with this kit, but I can go through some of my other icons here. Do I wanna do this? I'm gonna go with red. Yeah, I'm gonna go with this red. These are also Adorably Amy Designs. Um, and I'm gonna layer that with some of this deco here. I'm gonna do it with, I'm gonna do it with this one. I like this one. Okay. We're gonna do this here, like so. And trash day, like that. And then homework on that day can fit. I will do homework on a red box again. Do homework on this one. That works. Yep. And last week, I think, for the kids to probably have any homework coming home. Maybe one more week. But, um, yeah. Okay, so now we need our like our to do list, but I do not like having this line here. Take that line out, and then I'm gonna go ahead and put my to do list here, even though that's already got a header. I don't mind that. Okay, and we did the blue and red. We'll do the darker blue on this one. Come off of there. For the to-do list. Ah, it's not listening to me. Okay, perfect. All right. Okay, so that's Wednesday and we're gonna flip it over. And we're on to Thursday. Um, Thursday, I do have that meeting in the morning. We already put that meeting sticker on here, but because it's that same pattern, I want to put a header on first, break it up. I actually have another event. Um, now I think I'm going to do blue with this one. And this one's going to be a little bit later in the day. So I'm going to put it here. Um, we have our um, orientation for the fifth graders that are coming up to be in sixth grade next year. And we do like a virtual orientation. So that's going to be an evening event at work. Add that in. Okay. All right. And let's see which full box do we want to do? What colors did I do here? I did red, blue, red. I think this would be a good spot to put maybe the flower in. I don't know. I did the flower with that meeting too. We're gonna do this one. This works. It's a rocket because it's like the rising fifth graders on that day. So that's gonna be cute. But I do want to continue my pattern here with separating the meetings and the things out with the headers. And like this. There we go. And you know what? I'm going to move this actually. 
because I need room for homework and stuff. Should be the last night for the homework. But um, I'm going to move that since I'm not yet exactly in an hourly and not marking it up. This is what that kind of gives me a little bit of freedom to do. Move that up just a little. Okay. And then I can do this part here for the to do's for that day. <laughs> you know, it's kind of, it's the to do's, but really it's more like the done list because I do tend to come back and fill in my to-do list with the things that I did get done so I can check it off. Um, I mean, are we actually a planner if we don't do those kind of tricks? So, okay, so I'm going to put this flag here for my little done list and then homework. What color homework did I do? So I did black, blue, black. I think I have another blue one. Let's see. Dark blue. Why not? Let's do a dark blue one. I'm really just going to use these up. These homework stickers are like, um, uh, I want to say Happy Planner. What is it? The Mambi or whatever? I don't know. It's in one of those Happy Planner type books that I got. So let's see. I'm going to put this. Here, I'm going to go like this with this little arrow. Homework. Okay. Thursday's done. Friday. Friday, Friday, Friday. Hmm. No video, or no, not videos, no meetings. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, no meetings on Friday. However, my brain did just tell me that I did not put my videos in yet. So where are my, oh, they're in here somewhere, YouTube stickers. Here they are. I need to add those in, so... I'm going to put these out so I remember right there so I see them so I can go back and add those in. Um, okay, so now I'm going to do these. Let's see, let's do some balloons. There we go. Some cool balloons. Is that straight? That is super crooked. Do I care? I don't know. Depends on how well this is going to peel up. There we go. It's still crooked. You know what? I'm looking the other way at this point. Okay. And let's get a header on there. And then... All right. So, no meeting. Everything's good there. I'm going to put this one here. All right. And then I'm going to put the little emoji. That always signifies something's going on <laughs> for my husband's schedule. So, that's the emoji I use for him. Okay, so I don't need to put the um, homework on Friday, but I will do also the to-do list, and then we'll probably do like family night Friday stuff, depending on the weather and all of that. But it's generally like takeout night or pizza night or something like that at the end of the week, and then like a family movie or if it's nice outside. It'll be like, you know, playing out in the backyard or something. But that's definitely family time. So I'm going to go with the light blue on this one. Okay. Okay. 
Oh, my washi came up. All right, there. And then I'll just leave this bottom one down. You know what I could do? Light blue. I'll put this. I'll stick this down here for whatever family night event is going to have happen, and I can fill it in. Okay, so now we're at the weekend. Um, this kit does not have a weekend banner, so I'm going to pull from my other weekend stickers. I'm going to grab this one. It's little, but that's what I'm going to use this week. I'm trying to use up everything I can without buying more lately, so I'm going to use that next week's sticker as well. Um, you know, try not to be so wasteful. Okay, so I'm going to come here with the same Simply Gilded washi I was using before, but this is a the thicker one, and actually wipe the bottom part of this out. Okay. Let's see. Now, my weekend is going to be um, kind of open as far as what I put in the plans right now because we don't have we don't have our plans set in stone quite yet. We're working on it, but they're not set in stone quite yet. I mean, the weather is definitely going to dictate. So I'm going to leave it open so I can go back and fill it in as I figure it out. So I'm going to grab this weekend sticker. There we go. And throw that right there. Perfect. All right, and then I got my little next week sticker. So down here on this weekend portion for my next week, what's coming up. I always do this on the end of each week so that the things coming up the next week, at least the three top things or the big things or however you wanna phrase that, I'm thinking about it ahead of time if I need to as I'm making forward plans. So that's what this is going to be for next week. Okay, sorry. That was kind of off camera there. Um, all right. I'm going to white out this part and put some full boxes in here. I'm going to do... Do I have room for this one? Let me see the space that I used with that washi. So it would go over the washi. But that's okay because I could technically... All right, let's see if this is going to work. Sticker doctoring here. Put that in right. Kind of lines up, too, with that other red on that. Pull that up and lay it down. Oh, check that out. I kind of like that. And then I can always put a script sticker right there if I want to for something that's coming up. I like the way that worked out. Looks like I planned it, but I definitely didn't. Okay, so the only other full box I have left is this rose. I'm not quite sure what I'm gonna use that for yet, but it'll probably get used. The only things left that I need to make sure I get in here are my videos. Um, so I need a smaller box. I could even put it in here. That's a good idea. Okay, I'm gonna do this one here and I'm gonna throw it right here. Okay, and because on Thursday, um, my the monthly plan with me for June, will be up. So that's already scheduled. And then this one, we'll do the blue. put it here so Tuesday is the plan with me that you're watching right now okay and so then that's the weekly plan with me so I kind of want to use this mason jar sticker here it's super cute um, Gonna throw that mason jar sticker there and a 
look at this super cute cupcake. I mean, come on. Look at that cupcake there. I love that. All right. And then we're going to throw, let's see, Brave. And USA. And free. I like that. And then I'll just come here and trim off the part that's sticking out. There we go. All right. And I think that's it for this week's plan with me. I'll fill in the rest of the stuff as my week goes on. I still need to go downstairs and do my menu planning for the week. And yeah, that's it. So here we are. Um, I really like the way it turned out. It's very simple. Like I said, it's not a very busy week at all, um, but things will fill up. And sometimes I prefer weeks like this where it's just really kind of open and I can put in what I need to put in and it gives me time to get things done that I've been wanting to do for a while. So um, thanks for watching and don't forget to like this video if you liked it. Subscribe if you haven't already on my channel. I'd love to have you uh, come back and watch more videos. If you have any comments or anything you'd like to chat about planner wise, stick it down in the comment section um, and I'll be sure to respond. Have a great week. Enjoy your Memorial Day weekend. Be safe and I'll see you next time. Bye.